express rupees and paise as decimals and fractions. Today, let's revise how to express rupees and paise as decimals and fractions. Firstly, let's express rupees and paise as rupees in decimal form and in fraction form. We know that 100 paise is equal to 1 rupee, which is expressed as 1.00 rupee as a decimal. Thus, 1 paise is expressed as 1 upon 100 rupee as a fraction, which is equal to 0 0.01 rupee in decimal form. Now, Let's solve an example. Express 34 rupees 85 paise as rupees in both decimal and fraction forms. In decimal form, rupees form the integral part and 99 paise or less form the decimal part. Thus, 34 is the integral part and 85 is the decimal part. Therefore, 34 rupees 85 paise is expressed as 34.85 rupees as a decimal. In fraction form, the rupees form the whole number part and paise are written with 100 in the denominator to get the fraction part. So, 34 rupees 85 paise is expressed as 34 and 85 upon 100 rupees as a fraction. Next, let's express rupees in decimal form and in fraction form as rupees and paise. We know that for rupees in decimal form, the integral part is rupees. And the decimal part is paise. Therefore, rupees 548.45 is same as 548 rupees and 45 paise. Rupees 11.00 is same as 11 rupees and 0 paise. And 4 rupees in fraction form, whole number part is rupees and numerator of the fraction part is paise. Thus, 68 and 6 upon 100 is 68 rupees and 6 paise. Kids, learning about rupees and paise will be very helpful in your day-to-day -day transactions.